earthquakes happen, seismic waves radiate, and these waves are recorded by seismometers. These seismometers measure usually up and down motions and two horizontal motions. But the ground also rotates around three orthogonal axes, and it has been very hard to record, even impossible, and it's not routinely done in seismology. Now, we've been interested for quite some time in rotations, and we used uh, large, uh, bulky, very expensive ring lasers to make these observations, then also for geodesy. And of course, they cannot be uh, put in the field. So we were always looking for a portable sensor that's uh, as broadband sensitive as is required by seismology. Now, a couple of years ago, um, we teamed up with the uh, company IX Blue in France, and they developed a new product um, uh, range, adapting their navigation type technology, fiber, op fiber optic technology, uh, for the um, requirements in seismology. Now, the purpose of this paper is really to test this sensor. And testing means verifying. Verification means comparing either with another sensor or also uh, with array-derived rotations. If you have a seismic array at appropriate scale, um, you can actually uh, derive from these observations, from the array observations, also these rotational motions. And under beneficial circumstances, you can compare um, the array-derived rotation with a direct observations, for example, at the center of this array. And this was done for an array in Taiwan with our Taiwanese colleagues. Um, and you, you can see here, that's maybe the most expressive graph in the, in the paper, uh, a comparison between such an array-derived uh, rotation uh, recorded with totally different physical principles uh, and the direct observation uh, using this uh, blue side sensors, blue side sensor that was developed uh, by IX Blue. So to basically uh, sum up, the, the conclusion is really, yes, we, we now have a sensor that's fit for uh, applications in seismology, in volcanology, for side effect uh, characterizations, for ocean flow observations, whenever tilt or rotations uh, are an important aspect in the, in the ground motion. So these are the people involved uh, in the paper. Uh, Shi Hao Yuan is the main author. Uh, of the paper with our Taiwanese uh, colleagues uh, involved. And uh, we want to thank a couple of organizations um, that helped with, uh, uh, in, with this research project. And also, last not least, we're lucky to make it uh, with our publication here on the title page of uh, BSSA. Uh, that's a picture uh, of Stromboli Volcano. Actually, that's uh, Joachim and Felix, very close. Uh, to the vent of, uh, of Stromboli. It would be impossible to go there now. As you know, there have been uh, major explosions uh, recently. Uh, this was actually the first uh, field site uh, in, onto which the, uh, the blue site was, uh, was sent and, and first recorded rotational ground motions. So, hope you enjoy the paper and you can follow the links uh, below for further information. See you soon!